Hi guys, this is Duncan from Dunksweb.com. Uh, on my YouTube channel, a lot of people have been asking for cool websites, uh, downloads and things like that. So today we're going to talk about 10 interactive websites. Now this is just a taste of what's coming in the future because me and the guys on Dunksweb are actually trying to build a database for you of really cool websites. We've got funny, games, interactive, random and weird. Now you can help us in the hunt of these. Uh, you simply need to sign up to the site, go ahead and click the website link at the top and you can go ahead and add the cool websites as well. So I, I'd really love you guys to do this because I'll be pulling the websites that people have posted on a YouTube video. So let's go ahead and go into the interactive area. There's 10 websites here. You can see some users have been adding into here. So the first one is Google Gravity. And there we go. Simple as that. It chucks Google across the page. You can also search and there you go. It does the search results as well. I've been very tempted to uh, have this as my homepage for a while and try and search with it just to, you know, spice things up a bit. So that's the first one, Google Gravity. Next one is a virtual keyboard. If you haven't seen this before, it's a very basic keyboard. So you click the screen and it uses the middle line on your keyboard, so A S D F G H J K L to use the and you can click as well. And uh, you can also change the instrument, however it does reload the page. And you have to click again, but it does work. And also you can have drum beats with it as well. So yeah, that is a very basic keyboard. If you're interested in making music but you only care about a small keyboard, then you can go ahead and do that. The next one is MBB 2.0. Now I really like this one. Um, it loads a bunch of different instruments from YouTube or people playing them on YouTube and it mixes them together. So I'm going to choose a couple of ones I liked. You can do these in any order at any time. Very peaceful. A DS there. <laughs> I think it sounds pretty cool. So you can do this in any order. Yeah, that's MVB 2.0. The next one is a string spin. This is one of those interactive things where you draw and it kind of circles it. So there we go, I can just sort of move things around. And it simply spins one of those interactive drawing ones. Very, very nice. I like it. So that was string spin. The next one is how many of me. Find out how many people have your name. So if I go and type my name in, search your names. There we go, there's 10,918 people with my first name, 1,091 people with my second name, and one person or fewer with both names. So I'm quite, I have quite a unique name, which I'm quite happy with, so feel free to see how many people have your name. The next one is how many goats. Now this is a bit random, so I'm going to try and answer these as quickly as possible. You get 10 questions, so I'm going to say I'm a 35 year old that uh, lives at home, um, I'm a doctor and uh, I would like a Slurpee on a hot summer day. I am gangster. My car breaks down, I will call my dad because I'm 35 and there ain't nothing like watching the game with the boys. Actually, oh, I should have gone with gangster rap, damn. How would you, uh, how would others describe your smell? One with nature. Uh, you have one person note in a Sharpie, what would you do? A stick man holding a banner that says cool. And uh, I agree to be locked into an empty room for a week. You're allowed to bring one of the following, I'll bring green eggs and ham or to kill a mockingbird. There we go. My goat worth is six apparently. I'm getting there, albeit slowly. Nice. How many goats.com? A bit random. We may have to move this to the random section. So the next one is Amigle. So I actually talked about Amigle in one of my older videos, um, but there's a few changes to this. They now have video chatting, so similar to chat roulette, which I'm sure most of you guys know about. And also there's a new spy mode, which means you can uh, pose a question and then two random people will talk about it. But I have noticed when I've been trying the spy mode that um, both people usually disconnect. And also when you're actually talking on here, you'll find a lot of people are there for nefarious reasons and also to try and get you to watch them on the webcam while they do, um, shall we say, interesting things. So you can also get this on the App Store as well. So that's Amigle. Won't waste your time trying to find someone that will actually speak properly. So the next one is Personas. Type your first name and last name and see how the internet sees you. Now I think this is going to load for a short while. So I'm going to go ahead and choose the next one, which is URL Hunter. So you click this, you can see straight away in the bar you have to try and kill the A's. You can see my URL bar, I have to press space when I see an A. 
or move across so I can get an A. I'm sure you guys are better than better at this than I am. Let's go all the way across. Come on, I can do this. Ah, there you go. I killed four animals in 15 seconds. It's pretty cool to have that working inside the URL bar. And uh, yeah, that pretty much works like that. So, oh, for some reason the other one closed out. So I'll open it one more time and we'll go on the last one, which is ha 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 dot fr, which is interesting. This has got a loading bar as well. For some reason the other one's closing out. We'll try that in a second. So this is just, uh, you can use the keyboard and it will, he'll laugh in various ways. So E. P. Oh, that sucks. G. No. <laughs> F. M. So if you try and do them all together. <laughs> Apparently there's a secret combo. If you guys know the secret combo, then let me know in the comments and we'll try this next time because I have no idea what it is. I've been trying, trying to get all the different combos on here. So is this uh, Persona going to work or is it going to close out on me? I've got a feeling it might close out on me. Maybe because I opened something else up. But yes, uh, while that's loading, we have the uh, website database we're working on. We also have a freeware database if you're interested as well. So we're taking the most popular things on the channel and we're trying to give you a space to work on the website. So, Duncan Mail, let's see how the internet sees me. They probably think I'm, a, I'm an idiot, but we'll see. I did do some of these live as well. So if you guys watch the live stream, um, we do check out these out. So apparently you're characterizing it. Uh, screencaster, oh, alright, so this is taking this from my uh, YouTube thing. I found it Mob 3, it's a little bit out of date now. Dig, dig, all topics. So, a lot of my stuff is online, apparently. Some sports in there, really. Some fashion in there. Uh, partly professional, well, that's good to know. Um, I believe it's going to take a fair amount, but you can see you can, it's, it's going through each thing here and it's trying to search them to try and. Apparently fame is quite high on my list. So yeah, we got a result yet? There we go, online, so quite a lot is fame apparently, a little bit of sports, management, genealogy, family, education, movies, news, illegal, apparently, <laughs> illegal, uh, social, religion, professional and arts, apparently I'm a religious person. So anyway, this is the personas and these were the interactive websites. Now if you want to add your own in, simply click add website. And all you need to do is find a category for it, put a website name, put a description, put a link, and save it. But obviously keep them clean, otherwise you'll get banned from the site and your website's removed. So thanks for, uh, thanks for watching this video, and uh, if you did get to this point, please say, well good. Or something like that. Yes, thanks for watching this video, please comment, rate, subscribe if you like these videos, and I'll see you guys on Dunk's Web. Bye!